throwing in that white towel is not an option here. All right. So, when things aren't made in the United States anymore, and we outsource everything, I'll show you what happens. So, about two weeks ago, I noticed that the brake fluid was getting low in that nice new Dodge, the 21 Ram, and filled it up, figured maybe Hey, I've been pulling trailers for four weeks and maybe the brake pads wore down a little bit and had acid fluid. Not a big deal, right? Well, fast forward two weeks and I come out this morning, charge the truck up, brake light comes on, I check the reservoir, empty again. I check all the calipers and the front driver's side caliper had res had residue on it from the brake fluid so after inspecting the line the little rubber hose that goes from the steel line to the caliper got a little split in it and it's leaking brake fluid now show you this now now my 99 dodge all i had to do was put some air in the tire and uh fire it up okay it's got all steel lines and of course the old school brakes had the steel lining inside the hoses. They weren't made in other countries, we'll leave it at that. So got the boys cleaning this truck out real quick. Real quick. Ha, real quick. You know. Had like I don't know. Four years of yuck in it. All I can say is things aren't made like they used to. I'm bringing it back old school. Old school means you're strong, you're reliable, and you don't break down. You gotta keep going. If I would've broke down this morning, mentally, we wouldn't have gone out. We wouldn't have mowed these yards. We wouldn't have made that money. And I would have had five extra yards on my list for tomorrow when I'm rolling solo. Not a good idea, right? Don't give up. Don't throw in the towel. It'll all work out just fine. Peace.